Hi, my name is Vibeke and welcome to Diving Dogs Crochet. Today I'm going to show you yet another edge tutorial. And if you want to see all my other edges, then go ahead and check out the playlist on my channel page. The edge today will be the Bubble Springs edge, which is a lot of chains and then these bubbles with double triple crochet in between. So the first row is a row of double crochet. I just did that. I assume you all know how to do double crochet. So just begin with one row of double crochet. I will mention that this pattern works in multiples of 11 plus 1. Now I will chain 1 to turn. So just chain 1 and turn. Then we skip the turning chain and do one single crochet in this next. So one single crochet in the first double crochet. Okay, then chain nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And then do a slip stitch in the third chain from the hook. So one, two, three. In this one, I will do one slip stitch. And then chain seven. One, two, seven then skip 10 double crochet and then a single crochet in the next 10 and then a single crochet in this 11th one so insert the hook and single crochet and then we have this little one then we repeat so we chain nine And then a slip stitch in the third chain. One, two, three. One slip stitch. Then chain seven. And seven. Then we skip ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Work a single crochet in the eleventh one. And just repeat this step all the way across. When you're done with row two and it looks like this, you will now chain five to turn. One, two, three, four, five. And that's it. Now we want to begin working with bubble stitches and we will work the first bubble into this chain gap up here. And we will do the bubble with um, double treble. So we yarn over three times. One, two, three. Then we insert the hook into this little loop we made up here. Just find the center and insert the hook. And then yarn over, pull through, yarn over, pull through, two, yarn over, pull through, two. And then we leave it on the hook. Then we work another double treble into the little center. One, two, three. Then insert and work the double treble until you only have one loop left of this double treble. And that's it. And then work another one. One, two, three. Insert in the same little loop. And finish the stitch until you only have one loop left of this treble. Double treble, sorry. Then you have your three trebles sitting right here. And then you want to pull through all of them. So you yarn over and then you pull through all four loops. And then you made your first little bubble stitch. Then we chain five. One, two, three, four, five. And then we work another bubble stitch into the same center. So one, two, three times yarn over. Insert the hook in the same center down here. And finish your double treble until, until only one loop is left on the hook. Then yarn over three times. Insert the hook in the same center again. 
and finish the stitch until you only have one loop left. And then one, two, three in the same center. Finish only one loop, loop lift. And then you have four loops on the hook. Then you yarn over, pull through all four. And then you repeat once more. You chain five and then make another bubble stitch. And then when you have three bubbles, you will finish with a double treble crochet in this single crochet down here. So one, two, three. Then insert in the single crochet right on the bottom. And then finish your double treble crochet with all the loops. That's it. So now you have your first section over here. Then we would want to move on to the next one. And you just begin with the first bubble crochet, the first bubble stitch. So you just yarn over three times. One, two, three. Then you insert the hook in this center over here. And then work your first stitch. And then you just continue from here. Then work three bubbles and just repeat the step over here. Just remember to chain five in between each bubble. And this is how the finished edge will look. I hope you made it work. Bye.